Hey everyone, Spazzy Dragon here, currently at the office, so not using my regular mic, so sorry about the little buzzing sound. And as you can see, this is a video with a voiceover, so this is in 15 minutes of disco. I wanted to make this video to show you a certain little problem that we currently have in our latest patch. Now, this isn't exactly a glitch, and it isn't exactly an exploit. This is actually a game flaw that has been around ever since the game itself first was released, but sadly, also, this is the uh, game flaw that is currently most seen just because of the changes that we had during the latest patch. Now, uh, for those of you who don't know, uh, whenever someone takes down a lane, uh, Y the information about this is updated only to the people involved in the same system, so it means that if someone takes out a lane in another system, then obviously you wouldn't know it if you were about a few systems away, because this would uh, otherwise mean that every time uh, you or s uh, NPCs would take out a lane, then this information would be... Um, uh, this em information would be have to be sent over to 150 other players, which would obviously lag the game quite a fair bit. So, you know, what happens now is that uh, this is a particular game flaw that is currently um, borderline being abused in the sense of it's almost impossible to pirate at a gate. And in a moment I'm actually going to show you why. As you can see, I've, I've made a uh, test ship and I asked Ral to make one as well and we are going to try and show you what exactly is going on. For that we are currently at the New York Jump Gate in Colorado and in a moment I'm going to take out one of the lane rings. Now this might happen if you are pirating at a gate. As, as you can see they actually move the gates a lot closer to the lanes themselves and so these things get taken out by either NPCs or the gate lane guns or the pirate itself. So if someone's coming from another system, it's all fine, but here's the thing. It takes about half a minute for the lane to get up, so imagine if something like this happens. I'm going to shoot the lane right now, as you can see, but imagine if the NPCs do this, or the gate itself do, does this. So this is exactly what happens. Uh, the, the lane take, uh, gets taken down, obviously only the players in this system get uh, the update that, oh, this lane ring is down, if you take the lane, then obviously you are going to um, get kicked out. But here's uh, Ral, uh, as you can see, imagine he's a traitor, uh, as you can see the lane is completely down, but he uh, was not in the system when the lane was being deactivated. As you can see, there is nothing I can do as a pirate, apart from trying to ram the ship away from the lane, um, in order to stop them. So, that is the current problem. Uh, there is absolutely no way this can be avoided, and I know, uh, I know what, uh, you know, you're going to say that, well, you're not supposed to pirate at the gate. Uh, fair enough, but there's plenty of, um, lanes that, uh, even though you happen to be sitting in the middle of the lane, if the lane is one, like, if it's the one connecting uh, a station or a planet with a jump gate and somebody jumps into the system, it he will still go through the lane, and this is very evident in places like, for example, California. No one pirates at the California Majove lane anymore, because uh, if for some reason especially if an NPCs come, it gets taken down, and someone jumps into California, it's pretty obvious that it's going to take, be taken away. Okay, fair enough. Again, uh, maybe I'm not supposed to be pirating at a heavily armed gate, but quite frankly, there are plenty of ways to make sure I don't. For example, we have the lane guns, uh, the gate guns, which actually did hurt quite a little bit and actually still do, at least the pulses do, uh, but the problem here is that uh, you can do this uh, pretty well by uh, implementing these guns or the weapons platforms or whatever. Uh, I would not mind that, but I do mind where my uh, piracy efficiency, uh, effectiveness as a pirate is hindered not by um, you know, a deliberate, some some sort of deliberate mechanic, but a game flaw. 
So um, I have no idea why uh, they decided to move these gates a bit closer to the lane. Maybe it was because uh, traders were compl complaining that it was a pre um, a too far, or maybe it um, did some mayhem with the NPC pathfinding. Uh, as as we remember, there were plenty of NPCs getting stuck in the gates and um, the uh, the lanes. And uh, but this is not a good solution just because of this. And um, make no mistake, people know that this is happening and I've seen uh, plenty of players, both independents and actually uh, official faction traders, who know that this happens and if they see that I'm camping the lane, uh, if I'm hiding behind the lane then obviously the gate is shooting the lane, it's probably down. They are not going to stop, they are going to thrust to over to that ring and they will take it, they won't even try to roleplay. Or even worse, if you are a escort, for example, and you're escorting someone, then basically all you need to do is jump into the system, take the lane and drop a mine, and then tell the trader to actually go through the gate and follow you. Um, the pirate will most likely disrupt you, but by doing so, he can't physically stop the trader because it doesn't register for the trader. Just because, uh, you know, well, no, uh, <laughs> well, I sort of fucked up with that one. Uh, obviously, it does register with the trader if you, um, if he will knock out the lane. But, for example, if uh, he knocks the, out the lane and then you tell the trader to, you know, jump into the system, then he will instantly slip past. But, again, uh, the problem is that moving the gate closer does not allow us to CD the player because he doesn't need to go into cruise to get that trade link in time. Uh, there's no way to ram in uh, uh, unless you are a um, destroyer, for example, and you know pirating uh, at a gate with a destroyer is pretty much suicide because you know as as I already stated, pulls guns. So this wouldn't really be so much of a problem if this wasn't um, influencing regular lane piracy and. You know, the amount of times that this has happened to me so far has led me to believe that uh, the sudden drop in piracy activity might be somehow connected to this issue. Um, again, this was a, a thing back in 84. We did have this sort of uh, glitch every once in a while, especially f especially the Majov lane, because it was actually one of those lanes where the gate was you know, relatively close to the ring, and sometimes this would happen. And... Uh, Again, it was one of the reasons why, you know, Piracy 101, never shoot the lane down if you don't see a traitor. But, yeah. Uh, and that's pretty much it. This is a problem that needs to be fixed, and I'm doing this on purpose by actually showing you what is going on. But that's it. Cheers.